Hi friends, welcome to another video on essential life skills with me, Racha. Well, today we're going to talk about eight things to avoid at the dinner table. Well, meal times have become a very important part of family bonding as well as also spending time with people that you are dining with. And also, it's important for social skills to have certain basic dining etiquette. However, I'm sure you will agree with me on this that technology has taken over the dining table and everywhere you see people are buried into their phones while they are having a dinner or lunch with their peers or family members. Well, I'm going to share this small experience which has left me really disheartened. I was once meeting a really nice friend of mine, a close friend of mine, after ages. She was a dear college friend of mine and I was really looking forward, excited to meet her and catch up on all the good old times. However, when I met her, she was really into her phone the whole time and 80% of our conversation that we had, it seemed like she was having a conversation with people that she was with on her phone. It really made me feel sad to see that, that even when you are with people, it's important to give them your 100% attention and one of the worst things you can do is not giving them attention and giving attention to the people who are with you online on your social applications. So hence, it made me realize that we are living in a kind of a world wherein everything is app based or technology based. Even technology has taken over our dinner table. It is not really good to do this and we need to, to really understand that we need to block out people when we are talking to our family members over a dining table. So hence, today we are going to talk about eight things that you really need to avoid while you are at the dinner table. Let's get started. So friends, dinner table is ideally a place where you have fun, relax, chill and also spend time with the people you are dining with. So today I'm going to share eight tips with you which will help you overcome certain hurdles on the dinner table. So things to avoid at the dinner table, the first and the foremost is you need to eat with your mouth closed and not open. So do not chew food with an open mouth because it can be really looking horrible to the person sitting in front of you when they see you chewing your food with your complete mouth open. So it's important to know that you need to close your mouth and have proper etiquette while chewing your food. You do not need to show the rest of the world what is inside your mouth. So that's my first tip. In order to have good table manners or things to avoid at the dinner table, the first and foremost is eat with your mouth closed. The second thing which you need to keep in mind in order to really have good table manners is do not ever reach out right at the opposite side of the table if you want something. Well, if you want someone like probably, you know, you want salt and pepper, which is not close to you, it's a little further away from you. What you can do friends is ask somebody to pass you the salt and pepper rather than diving across the table and getting it around yourself. So let's not do that. Second thing you need to really avoid is avoid reaching out and getting things which are not close to you. The third thing you need to avoid at the dinner table is do not speak with your mouth full of food. Well, it once happened wherein I saw at a dining restaurant I was dining in, somebody was, you know, asking a question to the other person and the other person had his mouth full of food and he was really talking at length with all the food in his mouth. Well, it's a complete no-no. What I would suggest is if you are being asked a question with food in your mouth, what you can do is reply in a monosyllable like, mm-hmm, okay, yes or a no. Avoid speaking full length sentences when you have food in your mouth and that's really bad etiquette in terms of dining etiquette. Friends, my fourth tip in order to what you need to really avoid at a dinner table is do not be buried into your phone. So avoid all phone calls, Rather, I would say put your phone on silent or on a vibration mood. Do not really pick up calls or chat with people online. Give your attention to the person who is absolutely in front of you. Friends, the fifth thing you need to avoid is do not blow into your food. Well, if something is hot, for example, a soup that you're having is very hot, do not blow into the soup bowl and, you know, in order to make it cold. What you can do is just keep stirring the soup little by little so that it becomes cool by itself rather than blowing your air into the food and trying to make it cool just 
leave it for some time, it will get cooled by itself. So that's tip number five in order to something that you need to avoid at the dinner table is do not blow into the food to make it cool. The sixth thing that you need to really keep in mind is do not stuff everything into your mouth at one go. I see a lot of people doing that. They are in a hurry to finish their food and they stuff everything into their mouth, which looks really comical and horrendous. So what I would suggest is cut bite-sized pieces and put those in your mouth one by one. Do not shove everything. And also it's important to make use of your cutlery, which is your spoon, your fork and your knife. So let's try doing that. And that's my number tip six in order to things to avoid at a dinner table. So friends, the tip number seven, which you need to avoid at a dinner table is do not push your plate. By saying do not push your plate, what I really mean to say is when you're done with your food, it's okay not to push away your plate. Let it be, wait for the waiting staff or the waiter to come and remove the plate in front of you rather than pushing your plate away into anybody else's direction. It's a good thing or a good practice to just let your plate be, signal the wait staff to come and clear away your plate and give you something, some other plate instead. So that's my seventh tip in order to avoid something at a dinner table, do not push your plate away. The eighth thing which you need to keep in mind at a dining table is please do not use the toothpick into you know the place where you are dining it's good to use the toothpick in a private place like a washroom or away from the restaurant area rather than using it in front of people well it is really uh, you know again not a good practice or a complete no-no to pick your toothpick you know in front of other people because you don't want to do it in front of other people it looks really bad and also unhygienic so in case you want to remove food particles from your teeth which is stuck in your teeth probably what you really need to do is excuse yourself from the place go to the washroom and clean your teeth and come back and that's very important that's my eighth tip which you need to do or rather keep in mind in order to avoid things at a dinner table so friends here is a quick recap of the eight things you need to avoid at a dining table here it is tip number one is Avoid having phone calls at the dining table. Keep your mobile phones away. Tip number two is do not chew with your mouth open. Tip number three, never ever speak with a full mouth. Tip number four, avoid reaching out across the table to get something that you want. Tip number five, do not speak with your mouth full of food. Tip number six is try and avoid picking your teeth at the table. Tip number seven, avoid pushing your plate away. And tip number eight is do not blow into the food. Well, friends, I do hope you have enjoyed listening to this video on Tutorial Point. Till then, keep smiling, be happy and bon appetit. Thank you for watching us.